Earlier today, we interviewed Senator Murray uh, in the U.S. Capitol, and we asked her, how do you rate the federal government's response to the crisis in our state? I am as angry and frustrated as I can be at the federal government response to the crisis that we are feeling at home. When I talk to a family who has gone to a health care clinic really sick and they can't get a test, and I call back to uh, the agencies at Washington, D.C., and they make a false promise about the test being available everywhere, um, that is misinformation that hurts that family and it hurts everyone around them. And we asked, what is your office doing to bring federal support to people in the state? I have done so many things to try and press the CDC and NIH and, um, and the, the other agencies like FDA to get this on the ground. I've been told things that have not proven to be true. I'm going to keep pressing on that, and I'm going to find out what happened. So question, you've criticized a White House plan to offer businesses a payroll tax break. What financial assistance do you support? We need to target it directly to those people who are being impacted, making sure that they have paid sick leave. So when they're told to stay home because they may be in, impacted or because they have to care for someone who has a coronavirus, they stay home. So on the Senate floor today, Senator Murray called for a vote on her proposed legislation to provide 14 days of paid sick leave during the outbreak. Republicans have previously blocked the measure, saying it's too much of a burden on businesses.